Hello and welcome to another episode of Live Chess. Genub here and I hope you're all doing fine. I wish you all a Merry Christmas or whatever holiday you celebrate in winter, if you celebrate a holiday at all. Today I will play two Blitz games. So without further ado, let's get started. If you're a new watcher, this channel is all about me trying to improve at chess and hopefully you helping me via the comments. So our first game is against Bemtevi 2. Looks like we are going for a Scandinavian opening. Maybe. Yes, Scandinavian. It's not my favorite opening of all, obviously. Um, what do I do? Do I do this? I know I can, I could do better, definitely, without a doubt, but let's see. I mean, I want to develop my bishop here on d3, because um, I still want to develop this other bishop, although I could fanketo it, but then I would lose a defender for my knight, so I'm not really sure about that. Um, well, I think I will do that. The essential part is that I do not move the G pawn. Right? Yes. Hmm. Interesting. Like so. Okay. I st uh, should I should I shouldn't I maybe do something else? No, I like the idea of castling. I mean, yeah, eventually I will do that. I w I will do that. And by that I meant bishop on b two, of course. Now I will do this because this is a half open file and I like the idea of well simply having a half open file. Um, this will kill this will kill my bishop though. I will do this. I don't really think it's a very wise trading at this point. But I don't see a better solution. Maybe there were better moves that I missed. Um, I will do this. So if he takes, then I take. And then, yeah, I mean, he can come there with the rook, but I don't really see the point of that. Do you want to come over here? I don't know. What's the point of this move? Okay, I shouldn't waste the opportunity that he gave me. I like my rook to stay here and not move. Of course, my bishop right now is uh, not functioning properly. But if I'm, what if I push this way? What? I mean, okay, I don't think it's very wise uh, personally to do that, but you can, of course, if you want to. So what's my next move now? Because I could do this. Um, threatening the pawns, yes. Maybe I will just do that. I, I of course like that I have a bishop um, instead of a knight in this position. And... I 
Well, maybe that was a mistake. I don't know. Ugh! That was a blunder. I just didn't see the knife right there. That was stupid. Okay, let's see if we can come back from that. That was so stupid. Oh my god. So right now, his knight can go here and here. Well, he cannot move here. Uh, but there is this pawn. I hate this pawn right now. Um, take, take. If he takes, then I take. He takes, I take. And he's still two knights versus one rook. But my rook would then be able to. The blunder was um, unnecessary, <laughs> to say the very least. And now I am basically out of moves. I was so stupid. Why? I mean, um, that's a disappointment. Let's be honest there. That's a total disappointment. I cannot move the B pawn because he would capture. Do you want to come over here? No. Over here? No. Over here, maybe? I don't see the point of your move. I really don't. Maybe you just wanted to scare me? Oh, what? Well, GG. I didn't see that. But what if I do this? He basically... Was there a better move right there? I don't know. I don't even know, but uh, I don't have much time to think about this. Let's go, I guess. Rook for rook. Now my rook def is defending, of course, but... His knight is basically lost, right? Yeah. Let's see, because he has more pawns, and he's he's up for four points. You can see that right there. Oh, he's going for this pawn, right? Uh. No bueno. That's not good. I don't like my situation. But what if we do... No. I really don't like my situation. Uh... I was hoping I could get my king there, but... No way, of course. I was hoping I could get my king to f7, and then rook somehow there, so that I could deliver a back rank mate, but I think I, I also made the wrong move, because I... Should I? Yeah. I also think I made the wrong move, because I... Oh, I went there with the king, of course. Well, this is the last game. But we're still going to fight, nonetheless. We are still going to fight till the very end. Oh, cool. Where can I go? Oh, here. Right. Mm. Can I come over here? What well, then? No, then he could come there and deliver checkmate. I think this is a better move. If I had come to e4, I think that would have been checkmate. I don't know if I should feel bad because I'm playing for the time. I mean, I'm I'm not of course, obviously.
Um, let's do this. You still can beat me, of course. Well, that was close. And now I feel a little bit bad because I should have resigned. That was not very... That was not very kind of me. I'm sorry. So our second opponent is called La Quinta and comes from Slovakia. I never know how to react to this opening. Is this, is it called the Kero something? Kerocan? I don't know. I really don't know. What I know is that I should do this, because otherwise my pawn is lost. Okay. Okay, okay. There it goes. Bloop. Castle it. Um, do I see something? Of course not. I never see something. This bishop is buried, and I would like to change this situation, of course. Now, his knight has basically free roaming. Um, let's hinder the movement of this knight. And now he retreated. This guy is moving like a pro. What the hell? I don't really have a good plan right now, so I'm just trying to position my pieces where I think they fit well. And I think my queen fits well here. And I think my knight fits well there. And I think my queen <laughs> fits well there and I think h8 is an awesome square but wait because if I come over there then he could come there with the knight oh no wait I have a cool checkmate don't I this is a cool checkmate oh yeah Bam! That was so cool. Of course, uh, yeah, I mean, still very newbie, but very cool. I'm, I'm excited about that, and I'm, I am at 800, which of course is my highest rating ever, but still quite cool. So, thank you so very much for watching. I wish you, again, very happy winter holidays, let's call them like that. Um, if you're feeling particularly generous uh, and would like to help me, please, you can do so by commenting down um, below and even liking and subscribing if you um, are still not a subscriber of my channel. That would really help me. I would really appreciate that. Thank you so very much for watching again and bye.